Hi everyone, so I'm back to share another little journal with you. So I'm obsessed to making these little ones at the moment. Um, so this is quite eclectic, there's no real theme to it, just like using things um, that have already been um, trim, or trimmed, uh, <laughs> printed and cut out already um, that I didn't use in previous projects. So this measures six and a half by four and it's got a bit of a kind of rounded spine so it's kind of hard to tell I'd say maybe just slightly under an inch uh, I said two signatures 56 pages front and back will be listed in my shop um, if you're interested and I'll put a link to that below so let's go inside uh, I'll try and mention everyone as I go through um, here we go, that comes off completely. We've got some trims and some pom-pom trims. This paper here is from Artie Mays. That was a freebie. I can't remember what month that was from. I think it could possibly, possibly have been way back last year. So, um, the image on the front is, is it Pixie Dust Designs? I think that's who it's called. This in the background here is one of my freebie tags that I chopped the top off. Um, here we've got an Artie Mays butterfly, some cheesecloth, some bling. Uh, anyone's looking for that bling uh, in the UK, I got mine in Home Bargains and it was in like the wedding celebration area of the store because um, someone did ask me today and I have told them but just in case anyone else is wondering. So just some snippety bits here, the word treasures, Artie Mays. As you can see it's all been stitched so let's go inside. Um, now. I've been making journals, uh, can I just use in plain papers and then dressing them up? Um, and I'm going to do a video, I'm going to hopefully get that done uh, over the next day or two, uh, like a start to finish on, you know, decorating basically a blank journal, but having no, like, um, like no patterned paper in it, just like, uh, that's, that's digital and uh, that's digital, what else is digital? this little bit here but everything else is just coffee dyed papers of some sort so anyway right so here we've got a little envelope and then we've got a little tag and i can't remember where that's from i think that's the polka art polka dot art i think that's what it's called uh i'll try and remember and link them below this is from dreams etc and you can see this paper here is from uh bohemian crafting and i put that through my Bind it all to give that little look there. It's easier to see it there. And that goes inside. <clears throat> this is from Ruby and Pearl. Then we've just got a stamped tag here. It says this book belongs to. We have got a pocket with a little snippet on there. This is from a notepad. This is from Bohemian Crafting. And then inside <coughs> we've got... This is, this was just a little kit that I bought the, uh, the other day. Let me see. Oh, um, I'm just going to see if I can see who it's from on my computer. No, I've moved it. Oh, it's N Nikki's Paper Studio. <clears throat> um, she had a little kit on there, just a little ephemera kit. So I printed some of these out and I put that on vellum. Uh, I don't know if you can see like that's on vellum <clears throat> this was just a little scrappy piece and little tag there i think that's from um nick's what did i call it again nick's paper studio and that is as well um so i just made like a full envelope that is from one of my freebies over on my coffee shop so that goes in there <clears throat> um i don't know if i've got that as a freebie or not i can't remember but this is Artie Mays. And I don't know who that's from because it was in my stash, I can't remember. So here is Bohemian Crafting, some lined paper with some crocheted trim. These, got a few of these throughout and they were sent to me years and years ago from uh, Ruth Nelson, <clears throat> who is one of the admin on Junk, junk Journal Junkies. Um, but she has been very busy over the last couple of years um, and she's not really been about that much. But Ruth, if you just happen to be watching, um, do you remember sending me down? <laughs> so this, again, I can't tell who that's from. Uh, who did I say that was from? That is from Ruby and Pearl. 
This is from the old design shop, I think. And then here, these are like collage strips. You can find them on my coffee shop. Uh, that's RT Maze. I don't. I think that's the old design shop as well. And that just pops in there like so. We've got the centre of the signature here. This is Tsunami Rose. And we've got a little journal card there. Uh, this little ballerina. And this is Artie Maze, and that is from one of our wallpaper kits. And then here, I made this little booklet up. That was a scrappy piece. And I just put in, like, you know, the scrappy pieces of paper that you have left over from trimming things down. So I made a little booklet. I've got a little tag there, Ruby and Pearl. That is the old design shop. Little cluster there, and another word that I got from Ruth. Pom pom trim, little pocket. This is from Artie Maze. That is one of our wallpaper kits. This is from Nick's, Nick, Nick's Paper Studio. That is from uh, Dreams, etc. That's the knot page. Made these little. Um, they're like clusters, but I didn't sew them or anything. I just kind of popped them onto that little flap. This is from um, Ruby and Pearl. And then here is uh, Journal Bolt. That's Journal Bolt, little tag there. And then here we've got another little pocket, another tag. That's from Next Paper Studio. That is Dreams, etc. The story begins. And a little snippet there. So all the journals that I have at the moment in my shop have got a sale price on them. So if you want to grab a bargain, you can do. I will list below all the other journals that are for sale. It's been very slow um, this time of year for me. But oh, how cute is that? That's a freebie from my coffee shop. And the paper is from, I can't remember, I cannot remember the little ticket snippet thing here from Artie Mays. Here we've got a little tag that's from Tsunami Rose. Uh, that's the old design shop and that's Tsunami Rose as well. That is Ruby and Pearl. Centre of the signature. Another belly band thing. Um, what did I call them again? Snippet. Collar strip, that's what it's called. And again, that's a freebie on my coffee shop. <clears throat> that is Ruby and Pearl, some Ruby and Pearl paper that I backed it onto that you can just see around the edge. Artie Maze. There's plenty to write on. Um, another little snippet thing and a word from Ruth. Uh, another one of these printed on vellum. And another little journal card. So you can see it's quite eclectic. I mean, the only thing that's really, um, f you know, fluid throughout is the butterflies and the females. And the female images. And that's a freebie on my coffee shop, dreams, etc. That's part of a couple of pages as a freebie on my coffee shop. Another little snippet thing. Sorry if I sound all stuffed up. I am. <laughs> it's just uh, it's just the change of weather gets to me. And then here we have got a little tag there from Nick's Paper Studio. And uh, that is from, I don't know who that's from again. Is it? Don't know. Can't remember. I'm not even going to guess. So that is that little journal. And like I said, that will be listed in my shop. If you're interested, um, if you have any questions, just ask. Um, check out my other journals and I will speak to you all soon. Bye.